What's up, people? Welcome to the Thursday edition of Bet You Didn't Know That. I know a lot of y'all woke up this morning like it's snowing. And y'all was like, oh my God, it's snowing. Like y'all was surprised. Uh, people, it's winter. Be surprised that yesterday was 70 degree weather. That's what you should be surprised about because that ain't normal. That ain't normal. And if you stay in one of these bipolar states, you don't know what to wear no more. You were leaving out the house with a hoodie, some shorts on, and some Timberland boots. Looking crazy as hell. That's how some of y'all have been looking because the weather has been bipolar. But as my grandma would say, this is pneumonia weather. Put the right clothes on. New N-E-W, moan, M-O-A-N. Yeah, weather. <laughs> so look, we're gonna get right to the topic, man. Bet you didn't know that, man. Bet you didn't know that all the Charles's right now are tripping. It was two in specifically. Charles Oakley, man, and Charles Barkley. Charles Oakley went to the game last night, and unfortunately, he got thrown out of the game. How you get ejected out of the game, sir, and you not wearing a jersey and playing in the game, sir? He got ejected and got arrested, man. That's bad for business. You just going to get put out. So that's what they doing now. They just going to put you out. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't understand what's going on with the Charles Oakleys and the Barkleys. If your name Charles, you need to sat down somewhere. Have a seat. Have a seat. And bet you didn't know that, man. Bet you didn't know, man. Jason Dorello, man, was on a flight, man. And unfortunately, he had way too much baggage, man. He had so much baggage that they was trying to charge him 6 k in over baggage fees. So he told them, take him back to the gates. Unfortunately, the pilot wasn't feeling that. You know, them pilots got a quota. They got a certain time. They got to touch down. That pilot took him back to the gate and told him to get the F off his plane, man. So now he trying to sue them, man. Talking about... AA got a problem with him. First and foremost, sir, you know how it is. You got all them bags. Your ass should have been flying Southwest. You tripping. You out here trying to fly an airline that don't give a damn about all them bags. So, bet you didn't know that, man. Bet you didn't know why Lay, man, seems to think that um the Donald Duck Trump is uniting us. In what world, Wale? In what world? Because uh, Donald's trying to build a wall. Hello, that's called division, sir. A wall. He's putting a wall up. That's not, that's not, that's not unity, sir. Uh, <laughs> in other news, bet you didn't know that, man. Bet you didn't know, man. Um, not only is Donald Trump the only one trying to make America great again, Atlanta Housewives trying to make Atlanta great again because they actually trying to bring back NeNe Lee and Kim. So, I know most of y'all that watch the show know that at the end of the day, those two really make the show. So, y'all might get your wish on season 10. And last but not least, I think this is a very interesting bet you didn't know that. Bet you didn't know that. Bet you didn't know Virginia has a different kind of way of actually um, charging people and actually giving them, making it instead of them going to jail. They have a different way of actually punishing them. They had some students in VA that decided that they wanted to do some vandalism. So what they did, man, instead of actually sending them to jail and giving them jail time, they advised them to go pick up a book, man. Yeah, a book. You know, back in the day, the only way they got us to read is if it was Book It. You remember Book It back in the day because you could read for a pizza. Listen, man, if you enjoyed all the topics, man, continue to watch, man, because I'm going to keep giving it to you, man. I don't care. I don't care. I'm going to keep giving it to you. So, look, man, follow the website. Or on Facebook page, whatever way you can find out. And just so you know, I love you. And ain't nothing the devil can do about it. But I bet you didn't know that.